Poem number 24 of 30 American Poems by Various. The Song of a Comet by Clark Ashton Smith. A plummet of the changing universe, far cast, I flare through gulfs the sun's uncharted orbits bind, and spaces bare that intermediate darks immerse by road of sun nor world confined. Upon my star undominated gyre, I mark the systems vanish one by one. Among the swarming worlds, I lunge and sudden plunge close to the zones of solar fire, or mid the mighty rack of stars undone, flash and with momentary rays compel the dark to yield their aimless forms, whose once far potent blaze in ashes chill is now inurned. A space revealed, I see their planets turned, Where holders of the heritage of breath Exultant rose and sank to barren death Beneath the stars' unheeding eyes. Adown contiguous skies, I pass the thickening broom Of systems yet unshaped that hang immense Along mysterious shores of gloom, Or see, unimplicated in their doom, The final and disastrous gyre of blinded suns that meet and from their mingled heat and battle clouds intense o'erspread the deep with fire through stellar labyrinths i thrilled i thread mine orbit placed amid the multiple and irised stars or hid unsolved and intricate in many a planet swinging sun's estate Oft times I steal in solitary flight along the rim of the exterior night that grips the universe and then return past outer footholds of sidereal light to where the systems gather and disperse and dip again into the web of things to watch it shift and burn hearted with stars on peaceless wings I pierce where deep outstripping all surmise the nether heavens drop unsunned by stars and planets shunned and then i rise through vaulting gloom to watch the dark snatch at the flame of falling suns or mark the heavy dust and silent skies strewn thick with wrecked and broken stars where many a faded orbit runs and arrows sped from some eternal bow through change of firmaments and systems sent and finding born not bars, I flee, nor know, for what eternal mark my flight is meant. End of The Song of a Comet by Clark Ashton Smith This recording is in the public domain.